Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am Beatrice. I am Shamin. I am Emma. My name is Jaden, and we are your MCs for this evening. Pentabile is the National Junior College Choir's annual concert, where the junior high and senior high wings of the choir come together to perform different choral pieces, showcasing the fruits of their many months of labour. However, COVID-19 has brought us numerous setbacks and challenges, such as not being able to hold a physical concert. In spite of all of this, we have prepared something new that we have not tried before, presenting to you our very first e cantabile. The theme this year is around the world. Inspired by the spirit of discovery, we will explore the rich culture and heritage of our planet, and we invite you to join us in our journey. Allow us to first bring you coral pieces from all over the globe before taking you on a magical carpet ride through our original musical. Let us begin our journey in Africa with a lively and uplifting song, Baba Yetu. This spirit lifting and upbeat piece was composed by Christopher Tin and is the Lord's Prayer, a prayer taught by Jesus to his disciples, sung in Swahili. Without further ado, let us welcome the Combined Junior High and Senior High Choir. Baba yetu yetu liem binguni yetu yetu amina Baba yetu yetu liem jina la goeli tu kuzwe Baba yetu yetu liem binguni yetu yetu amina Baba yetu yetu liem jina la goeli tu kuzwe That straw was an upbeat piece to kickstart the concert with. 
Yeah, it's now time for the junior high choir to take the stage with their first piece, Terquero, originally an Argentinian Spanish love poem by Mario Bernadetti. It was adapted into a vivid and expressive song by Albert Favero. The melody, further arranged into a choral version by Liliana Cancano, reflects feelings of love and passion. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting to you the junior high choir, led by Miss Don Yi. Oh, my God. 
Thank you, Junior High Choir, for the wonderful performance. Now it is time to hand the stage over to the Senior High Choir. They will be bringing to you a song by Part Lusberg from Estonia, titled Otu, meaning the evening. Listen to the rich harmonies which blend to create a bittersweet sensation, painting a calm and gorgeous picture of the night. Now, let us warmly welcome the Senior High Choir, conducted by Mr. Yong Chi Fu. concludes the first half of Cantabile 2020. Now, the NGC Choir presents to you our original production. Let us tell you an old story anew. Once upon a time, there lived a great king who ruled his kingdom Agrabah with compassion and selflessness. With his faithful servant, the genie, who was constantly by his side to grant his wishes. He was loved by all his people, but soon his time was coming to an end. It was time for a new leader to be chosen in Agrabah. But will the princess, Jasmine, be able to take on this task? So, my king, what will your last wish be? I wish for... We often like to think that our life has meaning. But what if my purpose isn't one of honor? Should I just accept that this is my legacy? See, my father, the king of Agrabah, is seriously ill, and his dying wish is for me to marry this prince. Why? Just because that's how my father decided to write my story. So I guess this is my fate then tossed aside as but a middle man to a greater story. But should I really accept this? <gasps> He's... what? Psst! Psst, Jasmine! Father? Is that you? No, no, no. I'm very much alive. Who are you? Over here, in the chest. Spot that cool-looking lamp? What's this? 
Yeah, come over, come over, pick it up. Ah, feels great to be finally free. Princess, I don't think you quite realize what you got here. So why don't you ruminate whilst I illuminate the possibilities? Princess Jasmine, dear, what will your pleasure be? Let me take your orders, jot it down. You ain't never had a friend like me, no, no, no. Life is your restaurant, and I'm your major team. Come on, whisper what it is you want. You ain't never had a friend like me. Yes, ma'am, we pride ourselves on service. You're the boss, the queen, the shy. Say what you wish, it's your true dish. How about a little more baklava? Oh, Princess Jasmine, dear, have a wish or two or three. I'm on the job, you big the bar. You ain't never had a friend, never had a friend. You ain't never had a friend, never had a friend. You ain't never had a friend like. Friend like me. <sighs> Wait, so I can wish for anything? Yep, three wishes to be exact, and no asking for more wishes. Well, I'm currently stuck in this palace with a thousand people waiting for me to marry this prince that I barely even know. So it would really help if you could get me out of here. Anywhere will do. Show me the world. Bring me across the seven seas. All right, Princess Jasmine. Your wish is my command. Welcome to China, one of the most prominent countries in East Asia. Are you a spy? What? A spy? No, of course not. I just got here by a... Uh... Never mind, it's a long story. What's going on? Don't you know? We're currently at war with the Huns. Why are you here? If anyone else sees you, you'd be killed. My name is Mulan. Obviously, I'm not meant to be here either. But my family has been put in this situation. When China declared war against the Huns, my father was conscripted to fight in the war. But I knew he was far too sick to handle such an ordeal. In this situation, what else could I have done but to sacrifice myself? After all, family comes first. But to go that far? I love my father too, but I cannot see myself doing the same thing you did. After my father, the king, died, I was supposed to be the rightful heir to the throne of Agrabah. Despite this, my father never trusted me to rule the kingdom. I was always seen as a backup. My father would rather wed me to a prince and have him rule in my stead. to play this part Now I 
see that if I don't truly have his trust, I will break my people's heart. Somehow I cannot see how he thinks I cannot be. Tell me, Mu Lan, if your own father doubted you like this, what would you have done? Sometimes we have to do the things we do not want to do. To walk the path of righteousness does not lead to a life of glory. I have often dreamed of a far off place where a hero's welcome would be waiting for me, where the crowds would cheer when they see. But you know, baby, this isn't where we're meant to be. You will find your way. You can go the distance. You'll be there someday. If you can be strong, I know every mile will be worth your while when you go. You'll be right where you belong Go and find your way You can go the distance Don't care how far I believe you can be strong I know every mile Will be worth your while When you go the distance, you'll be right where you belong. Quick, you need to leave now. There's a path outside that'll lead you to a nearby village. I have to go now, but I hope you make the right choice. Goodbye, till we meet again. Genie, Genie, get me out of here. As I am around, no harm shall be done to my kingdom. Leave and never come back. Wow, that was an intense fight. I can't believe you have to deal with savages like them to protect your land. But why didn't you just kill them, or at least take them as your prisoner? 
Well, Jasmine, you know, this world we live in is a savage one. It's eat or be eaten. There will always be sheep that roam recklessly, and the wolves that prey upon them. In a world filled with wolves and sheep, who do you think you should be? I'm sure that most would choose to be a wolf. But in a world like that, you should really be a shepherd. Someone whom the wolves obey, and someone who can guide the sheep. For if the animals are left alone, there will be chaos. See, Jasmine, you play the role of the shepherd. Living your kingdom without a ruler is like the shepherd is abandoning the herd. Sunny days and starry nights and lazy afternoons You walk about your castle grounds and look for something new But somehow right before your eyes the summer fades away Everything's different and everything has changed if you feel lost and on your own and far from home, you're never alone, you know. Just think of your friends, the ones who care. They all will be waiting there with love to share. Genie, I don't know if I should carry on. I know I have a duty to uphold, but I just can't help but feel hurt that my father wouldn't trust me enough to rule alone, and that I need a prince to do the job for me. Actually, Jasmine, there's been something that I've not told you. Your father was previously my master, and the king before that, and before, and before, yeah, 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 and before, and before, wait, I think you get the point. For your father's final wish, he asked for... Wait, wait, wait. I think it's better if I show you some genie magic. So, my king, what will your last wish be? I wish for you, genie, to lend your powers to my beloved daughter Jasmine after I pass. Guide her to be the leader I know she can be. You see, Jasmine, it is not fate that we met. It is only when a king truly believes that there is someone worthy of the throne does he then make the final wish. And the king always believed in you. That's why I brought you here on this journey, so you can understand what it truly means to be a ruler. I know what I have to do now. Take me home where I belong. Knock knock. Genie, it's been a while. So much has happened. Yes, indeed. Genie, I've always wanted to say thank you. Thank you for taking me on that journey and for sharing my father's greatest wish with me. Without you, I wouldn't be where I am today. Serving you has been nothing but an honor. You have become a great leader, just as your father believed you would. Genie, I think I'm ready to make my final wish. And what will that be, my queen? For my final wish, please lend your powers to my son. Guide him as you have guided me, and I believe that he can be a great leader.
I can show you the world Shining, shimmering, splendid Tell me, princess, now when did you last let your heart decide? I can open your eyes Take you wonder by wonder Walk sideways as and under on a magic carpet ride Don't you dare close your eyes Won't you let this get better I'm like a shooting star I've come so far I can't go back to where Consider it done. We owe our success tonight to everyone who has helped make this possible. We would first like to show our deepest appreciation to two very special people who have never given up on us and have always strived to make us better choristers. May we put our hands together for our conductors, Mr. Yong and Miss Yin. We would also like to thank our teachers in charge, Ms. Chua Siok Keng, Mr. Demis Ko, Ms. Fong Mei Yi, Ms. Juliana Kok, Mr. Eun Kian Tiong, Ms. Mandy Kang, Ms. Mina Kar, and Ms. Wan Wai Su, who have always been there to support us and guide us throughout our days in choir. Not to forget our video and audio editors, as well as the different ones who gave their best to make Cantabile 2020 possible. And last but not least, we would like to thank you, our audience, for helping us make Contabile 2020 a huge success. Thank you all and see you next time! <laughs>